Welcome back to Bullet Catcher Gaming. This is, of course, Ghost Recon Breakpoint. This is going to be our review of the M110 DMR, which is a favourite of a lot of people. Uh, we've been waiting a long time for this to come to the game. Apologies for my voice still. I still have laryngitis. So bear with me. <clears throat> it is improving slightly, but uh, if you're a first-time listener to the channel, I don't normally sound like this, so... Uh, apologies so let's get in uh, into this one um, there is Delta loot available uh, for a few more days if you want to jump onto the discord we're doing a photo contest if you would like to join in and try and win some um, so ah the M110 okay sorry I'm really out of breath as well got a chest infection um, the M110 what do we think um, stats wise I'd say it's it's good i don't really understand why they say great handling at the cost of range because i actually think the range is really good uh, i think it's really accurate at range and if you look at the stats here on the left the range is decent it's really decent on the mark three as well obviously you have 54 damage so obviously that's decent as well um overall uh 7.62 obviously the magazine that i've got in uh, 400 rounds a minute uh, 3.15 on the reload and obviously 15 rounds in the mag um what i find interesting is it says 3.15 on the reload but i actually think uh it, it feels it's really weird because i've been using the acr a lot and for some reason, that ACR reload, I'm actually going to do some timings on that because it doesn't feel right to me. Uh, it feels like it's too, I don't know, it feels like much longer than what they say it is. Uh, but anyway, we're not here to talk about the ACR. But overall, M110, it comes with all the usual stuff. It's really, really nice. This is a really good weapon. Um, if you haven't got it yet, definitely pick it up. Uh, let's hit the range and have a look and see how it does. So we're at 100 meters here, and this is suppressed, and this is on single shot. I thought I'd have a little go of uh, just a few kind of roughly well-aimed rounds, but I thought, first of all, we'll just try without being zoomed in as such. Let's see if there was a lot of difference. Obviously, there is quite a bit of difference. Um, the spread there's okay. But for well-aimed, you probably expect better than that when you're using the zoomed in. Um, so I'm using the zoomed in now, as you can see. I mean, yeah, there's a, it's not a huge difference, but it's a small difference. So, okay, we're going to go back, zoom in, but we are going to change now to unsuppressed. Here we go. Single shot. Oh, like I said, these are just a few well-aimed. It's just giving you that kind of rough guess from about 100 metres. You know, if you're firing down on an enemy, what's the recoil like? It's very low. The recoil's really not too bad at all. You know, there's, there's that little pull that wants to take it up. But it's pretty manageable, as you can see right there. That's um, with suppressed. It's, um, it's really not too bad. Let's have a quick look with the drone. As you can see, there it is initially, right there. It's really not too bad. As you can see with the zoomed in shots there, they're, they're, it's a suppressed and unsuppressed. It's really decent, 100 meters, you are gonna have absolutely no issues with this thing at all. Um, it, it, I actually think it's already one of the best DMRs in the game. Now, for all you DMR fans out there, obviously let me know what you think have you tried it yet uh what do you think of it so we're gonna do we're doing full auto here as you can see well it's not full auto sorry it's burst um and as you can see already at 100 meters it's literally just going vertical um it bends very very slightly we're going to try the same again unsuppressed just to see if there's much difference i'm just letting it go heading back and letting it go it's pretty much the same you can see so if you're looking to make sure that you do take somebody out using the burst fire, probably aim. Um, you want to kind of go center mass. And the, the rounds will head up into the head, probably. 
you're gonna have no issues whatsoever i think this one's it's really decent really good let's try it at 200 well, so here we are at 200 this is single shot suppressed obviously zoomed in as you can see it's not too bad at all from 200 meters out I think it might be just over 200 meters actually about 210 so this is obviously unsuppressed you know these are fairly well aimed I mean I'm not slowing down obviously I'm just trying to get rounds down quickly just to see if you were under fire and you needed to use it what would it be like and obviously it shows there it's decent you know it's really not bad at all it's a really good weapon um we're going to try four oh from 200 meters now here we go pretty much the, like kind of the same as what you would expect effectively from when we tried from 100 meters the rounds are just going straight up vertical let's try it with the uh, without the suppressor on obviously this is a mark three as i said earlier there really isn't any difference as you can see between the suppressed and the unsuppressed doing pretty much exactly the same three same thing just a bigger spread from compared to the hundred meters uh, but doing exactly the same three thing um, going um, vertical and then just slightly off to the right but on single shot at long distances you're really probably you're not going to miss with this thing it's um it's really really good you're not going to miss um headshots and stuff like that you're talking one shots um i've one shotted some troops as well and um once you've you know you get those one shots down that unless you're talking about you know maybe some different styles of troops maybe some wolves you might need two on body shots but everyone else you're probably going to do it on one um i love this i think this is a really nice weapon let's know what you think um, this is just a short review and apologies probably not the best video i've ever made in the world because i still feel like crap but thank you so much for watching um i hope you enjoyed it please let us know what you think of the weapon do you think it's one of the best or worst or whatever um we'd love to hear what you've got to say uh take care we will see you again on the next one bye bye